just a few minutes. And unlike the last band that was on, they're a plural organization, not a singular. So these four guys will be jamming as four guys instead of one pig. Never mind. Uh, we also have a t-shirt going on. My God, we're, we have a lot of things going on right now. And the, the handheld is probably at this very moment trying to dance his way over to that darn t-shirt. And he's made it. And uh, this is a t-shirt in progress. And we started this last week. And it seems to work. They're going to make this t-shirt from scratch every week. And uh, if you want to be involved, if you're an artist, we invite you to come down and, and hog the set and make a t-shirt. Uh, if, if you're rich and want to fund the t-shirt project, well, that's also available and you can do that at your leisure. But uh, we'll peek back at the t-shirt, which obviously is in a growth stage now. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, it's one-fourth completed, possibly, or, uh, or more, and, and we're going to tool on to something different. And here we are with the steady cam in the background. Uh, quite a nice effect. <laughs> <laughs> Makes me dizzy to think about it. <laughs> Excellent camera work. I want to say a special thanks to the camera people we have tonight because these are real professionals. I work with these guys on a regular basis <laughs> and uh, none of them could get a real job so they all came here. But uh, they're doing all this for the fun of it, not the, the glory or the money, I'm sure. But uh, so again, welcome to Sid's show. This is Rosemary, the cookie lady. And it's sort of customary to open up the show with Rosemary's cookies because everybody wants to start glomming on them almost immediately. And, uh, Rosemary, what kind of cookies did you bring tonight? They are peanut blossoms. Peanut blossoms. Well, they Basically, look. Basically, they're a peanut butter cookie with a Hershey's kiss shoved into them. Shoved into them. <laughs> shoved. Well, and Peanuts some of them. Shoved. Some of oh, them. No, now, now, they looked a lot nicer until I was sitting at the bus stop on my way to the show, and it started to rain, and the only thing I had to cover them up with was my purse. So they got Oops. a little bit smushed. Well, I'm sure they'll taste okay. Structurally, I'm blocks. sure the flavor has not changed a bit. And our executive producer snags one first, as is customary. He has the quickest hands and the most idle feet. Right. So uh, <laughs> anyway, he does need new shoes. So if you want to support our show, send money for the producer's new shoes in care of God Needs New Shoes. And uh, I'll have a cookie on that note. And uh, maybe we could have the, our music. Oh my God, we have another member of our uh, little family here and and I think it's someone I already know guess. another guest <laughs> what go, eh? <laughs> the silent Way guest be, eh? howdy howdy he can speak eh? Ooh, what a relief um, do you have another story or poem yes, to read yes, for us? I did. so we have the poetry corner also and and I see Marty Holden the mister mister oh. magic himself <laughs> in the window so okay, well. we're all here now and we can make Sid show so let's go ahead and have uh, Infinite Beauty get up off their butts in a few minutes and uh, play us a song. Uh, they're they're ready, they say. They're they're ready. So so we'll. Uh, pardon me. Just intro. All right. How about a how about a song from Infinite Beauty? Beauty. Beauty. God, plural <laughs> singular. I knew this was gonna kick my tail. On two, ready, ready. <laughs> Present the lollipop kiss. Oh, if you believe in me and beta, and you'd have spirit, push out my blend. Register for clearance to mess around anywhere, anytime. Oh, holly plant, show pan, permit the mischief to carry on. With all your business, a child's still here. Yeah. You never did this, the fifth of our summer studio.
boys by the pillar, yeah, yeah. Just so the creep of some committee job of agency was mentioning the diary of Lavender and Judah. Do you know you are the angle now? No, you are the Harlequin show. Bam, the mythless trip to carry on with all your business. So, Charleston, oh, we never feel as good. Yeah, we really do. It's a shame when we don't have a large audience to appreciate the band, especially a band as awesome as these guys. Excellent, excellent. Very different flavor of music than we had last week, but music is music and it's all jamming. These guys happen to be really jamming. Um, we'll hear a lot more from these guys later because the rest of our show is, well, let's just say loose. Um, Rosemary's cookies are excellent, and we'll all have to have you send in for the recipe. I'm sure that the recipes are all available, right? If, if people were to write in to Sid's show and say, gee, I, I wish I could taste those cookies, you could probably get these recipes, and then God knows you They'd can make They'd have to send a stamped, self-addressed envelope. That's right, a self-addressed, <laughs> stamped envelope. And uh, then you can get the cookies. We could probably send them cookies in the mail. No, uh, no way, I'm not getting involved in that. Okay, well, that probably wouldn't work, and you'd probably only get an half an ounce of a cookie and that would probably be very unsatisfactory so um, is that t-shirt still going on I'm sure it is it looks like it is I can almost see it from here and it looks like it's got more colors involved oh my gosh it's really taking shape over there that's not fair I can't see well you can see it in the monitor Rosemary well Look, I can now but usually you're in the way, <laughs> <laughs> that's, what, out of the way. that's what they always say about me I'm in the way uh-oh, I see, I see shadows. Cookie, cookie monsters. Shadows lurking in the cookie monster shadows. <laughs> we see you. We see you coming. Here, here. Have a cookie. <laughs> Careful, gentlemen. They only took ten. Yeah, I noticed only some ten. cookies disappeared. Hey, there's some left. That's right. Well, I wanted the band to step out for a moment, so okay. keep talking. Okay. Okay, well, that's a good thing to know. From yeah. I want to the poetry. Well, we can go to the poetry corner. You want to get ready and, and, sure. and, and go to that in just I'll a just second? We'll, we'll talk for just a second about your shirt. And uh, while we're setting up the poetry corner, <laughs> Sher Sher Sherry, yes. you're, you're wearing a great shirt. It says. Yeah, would you like to see it? Yeah. The pig pen. Love oh, me. I think we're in poetry corner right now. Well, we're getting ready to. Mm -hmm. Poetry corner's in here still. When we let Poetry Corner out of here and out here, then everyone else will see it, big uh -huh. as bold. But right now, you and me are what they see, see, oh, over there? Oh, great. And Poetry Corner's still okay. in here. So what you want to see is my shirt. That's right. We you were looking at your shirt. This is a classic. Wow. <laughs> Rembrandt would have been yeah. proud of this. And, and I see that Isn't that's that on Drockman, huh? Drockman? Wow, well, that's kind of advertising. So you better turn around and oh, show okay. us the back. And I'll show you the back now. Is that the pig? Take the wrinkles out of it there. Of of course it does. Right, there you go. Oh my gosh, what is that pig doing? Uh, I have no well, idea. One of them's got I a heart and one of them's I thinking about me. some oh, fresh great. frog. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> well, they're drinking. <laughs> Pig's drinking. This is an important... This is Dan on the mic. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. Well, Sherry was a, a last minute guest, but yes, she's I really appreciated. She's not as last minute as I was. Yeah. Well, let's I, tell the I truth here. The John guest. was not flown in just for the show. That's John the line, Arthur, actually came here 
Because basically, he, he, <laughs> he was in love. This is true. He was in love. And John's yeah, to, love. The correct, the correct was, I am in love, but I'm in love with a little round ball and a little wooden well, stick that you hit it with. I didn't want to talk about the pigskin in front of everybody. but <laughs> It's not a pigskin. It's made out of cowhide. Cowhide. Oh, that's right. well, that's It's wrapped that's with much red better. thread. Oh, and then good. they call it a baseball. Not baseball. <laughs> but over 150 years ago, they invented this game. It was quite rudimentary when it, it was invented before the Civil War. And a guy would hit the ball, and another lad would run to the base, and mm. another base, and he would finally go home. incredible depth up to the surface and <coughs> breathe and real air. That's really deep. Thank you. Thank you very much. Hey, okay, no problem, man. Anyway, so we'll have Poetry Corner every week and we can look forward to that. Even though Sid's not here? Well, every other week, actually. And all this, even though Sid is not here. That's right. This whole show is here, even though Sid is not in that box anymore. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> that is kind of good. I like that. It look kind of strange. But you make a better Sid anyway. That's not Sid. That's <laughs> no one involved with this show. <laughs> <laughs> We're lost. Dan. Yes? How about another number from the band, Dan? Hey, that's what I was just thinking. Where did that who's who's reading from? my thoughts? God. How, how, about, how about it, guys? Infinite Beauties? Can we get it up again? Sunshine, dark so you know y'all digging a gold mine over here. Snake charmer, your angry tongue. See how bright the night's become for you. Ooh. And in the morning when the sky fell down on you. And the wind blow sliding down now back of a rainbow oh, I got three dollars up my sleeve I got a one for you and a two for me you see yeah. and would you notice if I scratch your face in a different place Scarlet ones, I say. Yeah. Ooh, 
looking for sunshine. Dark soul, you know you're only gonna go by the hell. Snake charmer, your angry tongue. Snake charmer. Another one? Can you guys do another one while my mouth is really full? It'd be a real blessing. Thank you. You guys are really jamming. University Cellar tomorrow? Yeah, no, it's next Wednesday at Firehouse. All right. Please not stand in front of the monitor. The whole concept of this show. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry about that. Excellent. Excellent. Well, you guys are really fired up. That's great. And uh, the sound is super clean. More sedatives. Okay, how about, how about another tune, though? And can you tell me that... Like, I think we should introduce the band. Yeah, who, can you tell me your names, gentlemen? On lead guitar we have, uh, and on bass we have, on drums we have, and right up front we have, uh, Joseph Graves. it's a beautiful world. And that was John Payne, our guest host. <laughs> Thanks, John. We really appreciate the help. This goes out to Tony Bologna, the last year clip. A fragrance confesses nothing, just a ghetto of letters erasing again. Confetti, Alfredo, en route to Babylon. Corridor de los dios en el negro corazón.
Though the eight for poke a very big hole in its forehead, I don't know. Maybe for thought control, who knows? Just a message of fragrance, confessing nothing. Just a ghetto of letter, erasing a gap. All right, all right. Bravo, bravo. Excellent, excellent. So you guys are, are local Tucsonans, right? All right. All right, well, we'll look forward to seeing you. We know where you're at. And you repeat it again and again to them. At the firehouse and at the cellar? Yeah. Be pimping some mean jazz. All right. Well, it was excellent jazz in here, and thank goodness, too, because this show is really loose, as I put it. Doesn't We're over here by the t shirt, I think. Or I'm wandering over here, I know that much. Um, it looks like it's really growing. Yeah. I, I think I've got this theme now. One of these things is uh, different from the others. One of these things is doing its own thing. One of these frogs is doing its own thing. Gotcha, gotcha. That's a frog. Those are frogs. <laughs> God, we gotta really work on the, the quality of the guests here. Cell. I don't know. <laughs> she doesn't even recognize a frog. frog. I thought it was like a bear. I'm sorry. I was going with an amoeba. A bear? You thought this was a bear? I thought it was close to a bear anyway. It a is dog. kind of a cutesy frog. It's a Kermit look. It's okay, really hot okay. right now. A dead Kermit look. Oh, nice. Now we're really getting morbid with the dead Kermit look. Yeah, the poster giveaway? Oh, yeah. You know what? I found out just questions from the That's right. I know. I found out just tonight that someone we know has got a closet full of goodies. And, oh. and well, goodies is kind of a relative term. Um, <laughs> he's got a closet full of stuff, and his, uh, his solution to emptying his closet is to give it away. These are rare treasures from, God knows, the 90s, the 80s, the, the 70s, and you never know what you're going to get. And I think there's some rules involved with this, and I think we'll We'll pick this up. Uh, oh, they're going to ask a question, and uh, and you're supposed to guess the answer. And I guess uh, people in the studio would have to be involved, or It'd be nice if we could have two other people involved. Yeah, it would be nice. We'll ask our guests and put be them on the nice. put, right. put put them on the spot. Uh, the question is, uh, and this is uh, from India's Veda of Spiritual Knowledge, or questions from the Bahav. Bhagavad Gita. Thank you for the Prince of help there. And the question today is, being freed from attachment, fear, and anger is A, very nice. B, the furtive impulse of a higher mind. Ooh, the, I think I said that wrong too. Like cr Christmas in July. Well, that's an obvious choice. That's it. Uh, being it would be nice if I'm going to read this, if you could write it just slightly more legibly. I don't have any problem with it. Being, being fully, fully absorbed, absorbed in, me. in me. Being fully absorbed in me. Yeah. I like B. He I likes B, I B. A furtive impulse of the higher mind. And, right. and you liked? I like the last one. The last one. I'd have to ask a higher source to find out the answer to this kind of question, but I, I think, I think, you're correct. I think it's I think so too. four. The answer is All right. being fully absorbed in, in me. me. In me. Way to go. So hey. I think you win our prize, <laughs> and now we get to find out what it is. What's Jay, could you tell us about it, please? He prize from Ben's Closet. Oh, we've got it over here, and I don't know whether they're going to be able to see it, but... This ben. is a full-color 16 by 22 poster. Captures legendary rockers Robert Bland and hey, Jimmy go Page. Ahead. And infinite beauty. This one is uh, also dedicated to Tony Bologna, who last night during the course of Sacred Duty uh, scorched his foot.
Hundreds of thousands of uh, dead Arabian people. Hundreds of thousands of dead Arabian people covered with the dust of the desert.
yo, Scooby-Doo, say what? A step into my office. Oh yeah, that's right. Boy, you know I'm really serious, serious, serious. <laughs> There is a werewolf who wear pajama Who drink the nighttime from lonely bottles Oh, they speak so softly of Golden River Where tired spirits can bathe forever Oh, behead the lover made out of lightning Who come like thunder across the island Oh, we floating sorrow, we're flying ponies with a volcano deep in the morning. Oh, Guadalupe, please listen to me. Sometimes your black eyes, they get so gloomy. Passionate handcuffs, unwanted foreplay, strangle the mermaid in Chakra's doorway. While stray roosters argue, a gargle desire to not the jackal, alone retire. And before the statue of Nosferatu, I lay my mattress and die without you.
right. Well, guys, I really want you to close up the show. We still have some more time, and we're, we got we got five minutes. I have one question. Who's on the bass guitar? Yeah, who is on the bass guitar? James. How about your names again, gentlemen? Infinite Beauty. No, the picture on the bass. Yeah. Oh yeah. Thought it was it's a killer flat top. That's baby. well written cigarette son. <laughs> We're doing special effects. Yeah, again we'll be playing at the University of Arizona Stellar tomorrow, like eleven AM and uh, over at the firehouse like next Wednesday, a week from tonight, I think. A week from tomorrow night. That's an evening gig, right? Use the patronage there with Dennis Mitchell. All right. Yeah, you guys, you guys can exit if you're really on board here. Ball right into the hole. Nicky Six, don't you cry no more, just behave yourself. Zion Thunder Hawk, shotgun at 12. The glass assassin got somebody else. Put those boxing gloves back on the shelf and eat the evidence. Oh, it's a living, dipping the glass. But with that old Good time barbecue man of the reason to not understand like the enemy. Champagne cocktail, full moon beach. Bobby Bone lost his fruit of the loom. Woke up screaming in Jupiter's room. Hope that, hope that cuckoo bird fly pretty soon. Hope it fly like an enemy away. <laughs> <laughs> 